Hello, this is Ever Pierce, and this is a continuation of Pyramid of Numbers M I E equals MC squared. Now, what we've already covered in part one of this, we're going to take it one step a little further. Now, I showed you is when it comes to science and logic, you have to come up with ways or a method or an equation in such a way that then when you test it, it proves itself to be reliable. Now, using my E equals MC square, a little piece to the puzzle I left in my previous life, okay, and, uh, and what we've already explained in part one, we use 113 square with 12769, and why do we use the last three digits? Well, in a solar year count, you never go beyond three digits because our solar year is 365 days. Now our year, if we keep increasing in years, and of course the year is, but that's a little different. But in a solar year count, you're, you're not going to go more than three digits because your to rotation around the sun is only 365 days. So we took the last three digits because 769 is too big of our solar year count. So it's it's too big. And that's why down here we took 769 and convert 10. It means these two numbers add to a 10. So 7 and 3, 6 and 4, and 9 and 1. 341st day of the year is December 7th. Okay. Now, we also had where we... Um, we took that, that was in our other page, and uh, we took 113 square, which is 113 times 113, and that's 12769, we minus 1. Well, this is a variable, and we see that also in our date, where every fourth year, because it's 365 days plus a quarter. That's why every four years, we add a day to try to stay accurate. Well, we're going to minus 1. And that's how we come with 12768. And you say, well, there's, in terms of my December 7th, 1968, it's presented itself several times in different ways. Okay. And in this method, in, uh, oop, like I have already explained. Okay. Now, I use this how to set up my pyramid of numbers. Now, that's why you have the arrows down here. Now, let's look at the arrows at the top. Is We know in terms of date, you have the month and day and year. But we also have an element of solar year count, which is essentially three digits, which is 365. Okay, so I'm left-handed. So things happen, start out on my right, ending with my left. So that's why we're going to read right to left. Three, March. We have up to 12 months. And then our next two letters, or numbers, is 31. March 31st. And then one, two, three, sequence. One, one number, two numbers, and three numbers. So March 31st. In 115, So, if you backtrack that down to zero, you will realize it will land on December 7th. So, so when you have a symbol like this, in the beginning was the word, and the word was God. If I advance this 2, 2, 1, E, F, G, E equals MC squared, is now G O D square. And I illustrate that in some of my other videos. So just with these numbers here, putting a logic, rhyme and reason, placement, these are all things that that we have to explain as a teacher of teacher, a leader of leaders, is there's a lot of people that teach out there. But very few are qualified, especially qualified on the level in which I'm on. As I illustrated here to you. 
Now, I do, like I said, I have videos on my server that teaches you how to properly set up your date baseline. And that's what 15 digits. It can't be 51 because if you had a baseline of 51, and I'll quickly show you, here's a baseline of 51. And if you did this up, that would be a huge number. It would come to 1,301 digits. And I basically did a countdown. 625 times 2, because 625 is top and bottom. So, so just basic common sense would say that it can't be 51, it's 15. It's how it fits in. It is, think of it as like a piece of puzzle. Is how is it going to fit in perfectly? Like a, an equation, a method, a concept, evolution. Is These are the things, or this is how you, you are supposed to be thinking, is how does it fit in? Okay, and if it does fit in, is what is it yielding? So that's what we know about science and logic is versus just being random as i just illustrated here in not not to mention this part too but part in the first part of this none of nothing about this is random i've been preparing for this lifetime as ever pierce and any other life previous life before this so there are deliberate things that i leave behind in man's timeline that way th these are things that only I would understand just like the last supper I can explain to you in detail what was going on during the last supper the 12 disciples couldn't but I could and I would explain in such a way that it would be profound he was like I've seen that picture a hundred times why do I not see it like that but it would take the explanation of me to explain it to you. And then it will make sense. Okay, so that's something I would have to explain to the world. So there's some things that I can teach and there's some things I cannot teach. But I, as a teacher, I have to teach in a way where I have, I'm going to teach you in the, think of it, the, you know, they call the fishermen. Am I teaching you how to fish? Or am I just giving you a fish? So as a teacher of teachers, I have to teach you how to fish. But I can't just hand it to you. Now you, you know, when you when you become part of this, you're linking your energy with me, God, and also linking into yourself, self-discovery. So you're practicing the element of discovery. You want to increase your relationship with God, with me, and with yourself. Get to know yourself. Get to know me. Get to know God. So these are just basic things about life. I'll back out here so you can see the whole page. And I... So in this part two, we're almost to our 10-minute mark, but just uh, look things over you'll know that we didn't just randomly put things together. So when I do a pyramid of numbers, or now you can relate this to anything in life, whether it be your job, um, anything. So this is the type of thinking you want inside. You want to know whatever it's all about. You want to know if you have the proper teacher or if the information in which I'm teaching you is even worthwhile. So what I'm teaching you is priceless. And we haven't even gotten into the hardcore meat and potatoes of this. So that's why I'm I'm showing this because some people feel like they you know they 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 need a teacher and that would be me. So you're welcome to visit my social accounts. If you don't know how to set up your date baseline and get started on that, go to PayPal, make your donation of $100. I have 13 plus videos there, and it will explain the date, 